Alright, so now we're going to talk about the new mobile game, Vainglory, from Super Evil Megacorp. There you go. And that's, <laughs> that's from X Riot Employees and X... Rockstar. 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 You really did your research. I did the research. <laughs> so, um, they came out with a trailer today, which we've watched. We watched the trailer. Twice. We watched it twice. Twice. Did you it's not like once, it's still in our so we're, heads. We're kind of experts. Yeah, we kind are of done experts all the footage presented. That's your yeah. right we're experts. And since TJ is big Riot fan, big League of Legends oh, fan, no. what were your first impressions of the trailer that we saw? Um, when I saw it, I saw a big, big League of Legends Summoner's Rift aspect. Like even looking at the background, the coloration is different, but overall, I feel like just the bushes. How the targeting works, like it looked like the spells and the circles for everything. It looked just like League of Legends. I did see a couple differences though, and I think they're pretty interesting. They made the damages that you take bigger, so you can see like, oh, I took 500 damage. It looks like 500 damage because it's like, like a big like 500. It's kind of like JRPG. Yeah, yeah so which is kind of cool. Yeah, that, that would sound interesting. Um, but I mean, overall, it looked looked a lot like League of Legends, but it had its own style, I would say. Yeah, yeah. and it is a MOBA, or mm -hmm. it is mobile. Mobile, so mobile, it says mobile, we're coming MOBA. to Mobile MOBA, which there's a couple of, uh, Solstice Arena for one, a couple other ones, um, but this one, so it's going to be on the iPad. It looked, I don't know, for me, for my first impressions, didn't they look kind of like slow? Like it seemed like everyone was kind of slow moving. Yeah, well, I, I mean, how just, fast could you move on your phone? I haven't played Dota, would you say Dota's slow? Because Dota, of turn ratio Dota is stuff? slower than League, I would think. I was, so when I saw it, was like, it kind of looks like... Movement wise, I saw Dota's like turning, but I, I couldn't tell yeah. that the turn aspect to it. Yeah, it was kind of hard because there was such quick yeah. cuts, but I feel like on a mobile, you'd want to be like quicker, you know, faster games. You know, the, you slow down the characters even by a little bit, and the game gets exponentially longer. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't know, but yeah, like I said, the, the action JRPG elements with like the, the uh, hit damage above them that was pretty cool. Um, but other than that, it's I mean, there wasn't a lot like to a see. JRPG references, or not references, but influences. Yeah, in it there. seemed like the the I'm assuming they're called heroes, champions, whatever they call them. Mm -hmm. But they had they had did have like a, a lot of movement, like yeah, yeah. you know, it's hacking and slashing, which was cool. Do we know if it's five v five or anything like that? Not yet. I saw a total of three enemies at the most so far on screen. Okay. So I don't know. Maybe it's probably it's five v five would be too much on a mobile. I think probably three is probably a yeah. good number. Look, Heroes of Order and Chaos has five v five. I did see the map had three lanes, though. Mm -hmm. I think I mean I'd have to go back to make sure, but I remember there was a bottom, and the way that the angle was would be three lanes. Yeah. So I mean that's maybe each person. I think most mobiles have three lane. though, right? Mobile. I don't know about mobile, but in general, like oh have yeah, three lanes. Yeah, three. Everyone's kind of done like the three lane with the yeah. with the jungle type area. Uh, Solstice Arena. That's only a three v three, and that's pretty much just one lane. Okay. Hmm. Um, Mark. Yeah. Sure. What about the name Vainglory? It's interesting. I, I kind of like did, it. One thing I did notice is they used a lot of words that are in League of Legends. So that Riot uses, like I saw Rise gank. pop up, Gank. Um, well, game is like such a general term. Yeah, that's, but, yeah. but rise, yeah. vein, you know, those are like I think those are really big riot words that just kind of popped up. Is there rise? I didn't see rise. Rise is the very first word that pops up. It says rise, it's spelled differently, but it's still like the word R's. rise. R I S E. While the champion is rise. I don't um, know if that's. Yeah. Well, I, I think they meant rise being, as in like rise that, up and being take that your they champion. Are right, and I being don't that, no, the, being that they are right employees, no rise is the iconic character. You know the word. I'm pretty sure the word rise somehow resonated. You know, like as, I will use the word rise. I mean, I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with it. I'm saying like those very, things popped up to me as League of Legends player. I saw those more flashy too. It's like, oh, that sounds mm -hmm. kind of like League of Legends. And then when I heard of Vainglory and how they separate Vain from Glory, I was like, Vain. Thing. Not the champion. I like again. I think they're just using it as a word. No, but the thing is, like these words resonate in your head, and then they pop out as differences or use them in different places. Like no matter what, you can tell that there are right employees working for Vainglory. Like you can. Would see you think that they're trying to capture thing. some League of Legends players? I mean, to have something they can play, not to replace League of Legends, because obviously I don't think that's yeah, that's not the but right on their phone. Like I would say, yeah, as a, maybe even like a practice tool. 
I would say, I yeah, I definitely. I definitely could see a League of Legends player like, oh, that looks interesting, and because it's mobile, it doesn't take away from me playing League. It's like, yeah. if I'm on a trip, I don't have a laptop, I'm just going to play some Vainglory. If I'm on the subway? Yeah, on the subway, play some <laughs> you know, Vainglory. That old San Diego subway system. <laughs> That's great. Public transportation here is... So great. Yeah, the developers did say they're going to cater to the hardcore MOBA players, despite it being on a hardcore. mobile platform. Huh. So what do you guys think, being hardcore I don't know. mobile I players? Like it, I personally I don't take phone apps very seriously. Yeah, me neither. Um, just because I mean it's you're on the phone. I don't either, but I will eventually. Eventually, you know, you're not gonna have your computer. You're gonna have a tablet to play your games on. Yeah, I mean, if the game was on the computer, I might play it. It's just I don't like playing games on my phone. It's tiny. Sometimes what you press doesn't really go through. I don't like, know if it's going to be on phone. It didn't. Yeah, it's, it's tablet a tablet. Or it's oh, like tab. Tab. Well, tablet. But okay. you know, yeah, phone is going to be way too small. Yeah, yeah you tablet. Can't, you can't but who knows if they'll phone. put it on PC later? Like, yeah. Um, but they said they're going for hardcore, so that's a, that at least shows to me that they're going to put a lot of effort to it, and they don't just want some casual like fly-by-night game yeah. that... Yeah, like Solstice Arena strikes me as, like, kind of dumbed-down, really simplified MOBA. It's a really good game, though. I'm not saying it's not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't... I don't. I wouldn't say Solstice Arena is hardcore. I don't know if there's a hardcore mobile MOBA. You know? And just knowing that it's coming from, like, Riot and Rockstar, even if they're ex-employees, even if it was just, like, an intern that worked there for a week... <laughs> They can still they, put, yeah. we're from Riot. Yeah, they still get the Riot, you know. Yeah. Whatever that word is. Persona. Street Mojo. <laughs> Street <laughs> cred. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those words that. they use and stuff, so. Uh, anything else we noticed from the trailer? Boobs. Yeah. Boobs. Ashley with her mind in the gutter over yeah. there. Look at those the boobs. boobs jiggled. I am sorry. <laughs> so even with the hardware limitations of tablets... We still get they the jiggles. We still get the jiggling boobs. <laughs> you can never take away the jiggles. <laughs> Gotta be realistic, you know. To have it in real life, they jiggle. It's did any of the oh. did any of the the heroes strike you as copies at all? I bri- I vaguely remember. I could barely see any. Of them. Yeah, they did very such fast. quick. I still thought I saw like an Aurelia, like the person with the blade popped out. I don't know why it just popped up as Aurelia. She looks like she was wearing more of a nurse costume, so I would say nurse Akali, but. I just thought like a really aspect, but oh no! Like I said, it was too fast. I didn't. I mean, really yeah, I mean, nothing think it was exact copy. Nothing. Yeah, I'm pretty yeah. sure they have. From from the way that they displayed the game, I think they respect Riot. They're not trying to compete with it because it's mm-hmm. mobile, and they don't want to obviously take anything. They're just they were developers, so they obviously have. They there are some of the reasons that there's things in Riot games right now. Mm-hmm. So of course they're going to use their ideas as their own. So now are they showing this off at E3? Do we know? Or? I have no idea. No idea. Okay. We'll see next week. We'll look it up. E3. E3. So that's Vain Glory. Mm-hmm. Super evil megacorp. Did I get it right? Got it. So yes. evil. Every villain is Just that, that developer's name alone wants to make me play it. Super evil megacorp. I like that name. Music note? I can't even... I don't want to say shit anymore, but that's shitty vegetables. Some guy's dumb club foot. Oh, I'm a monster. <laughs> it's like a briefcase.